Hi, I'm Allie Thompson, and I wrote this new and exciting puzzle book called Wildly Creative Puzzles with a Point. It's great for Sunday schools and children's ministry. Ever since I was a kid, I have always loved puzzles. Then as I grew a little older, I started to make puzzles and then forced my family to do them. When I grew up and graduated college, I worked at a church in children's ministry and I got to create puzzles there for kids. So that was really fun and I got to think about puzzles as faith experiences that way. And I also at that time led a workshop to help other children's ministry workers know how to use puzzles effectively. The book is set up with 52 different puzzles and you can use them in any order. They don't build off of each other. They're really meant to be something that you can add in for extra time in your lesson, but it's meaningful. Uh, so to write this book, what I started with was I picked 52 passages that I thought were foundational to faith. So as I read each passage, I thought, what's the main point of this passage? What are the faith takeaways that we want kids to get from this? And from there, I thought, well, from this puzzle list, what puzzles can help them experience that point and can get them to feel whatever this point is? So I kind of merged the two together and came up with experiences through puzzles. They're recommended for different ages, from preschool through upper elementary, so each puzzle has the age level it's recommended for written on it. And then it also has the faith points that you can teach from that puzzle. There's an index where you can look it up by age level or uh, by faith point. Otherwise, you can just go through, it's in Bible order, and, and pick something that goes with your lesson for that day. And each puzzle has a teacher's page that says how to lead the experience. Uh, there's debriefing questions to really make sure that kids are making discoveries through the puzzle. And then the puzzle page itself is reproducible for kids and there are take home questions at the end so that they can continue to make discoveries when they go home and talk with their parents.